Good day, good people. Welcome everyone, it's Gus here, and we're back here for another episode of the Days of Farming here in the place called Spirit, which is better known as Fruling, for Farming Simulator 22 on PlayStation 4. So welcome back everybody. We have cleaned up the overgrown trees here in this uh, other piece of farmyard that we just bought where the greenhouse and the sheep are. So we're gonna go sell this small load of wood and then we need to get over to the forest and start getting some other trees sold to carpentry, the biomass heating plant, and then the sawmill. So we will see you up at uh, Holland Sales to sell this load of wood here. All right, well, let's sell this load of wood and see what we can get for it here. And uh, then move on to cutting more trees up and selling. So let's get this sold. $593. Man, that's all we got off of that. <laughs> ah. We should got a little bit more off of that. All right, well, hey, that's better than nothing, I guess. All right, well, let's get on down to the the forest. We gotta cut some trees and get them loaded up. But before we do that, we gotta stop by the farm and we are gonna load up some strawberries and potatoes here on this trailer. Uh, we'll need to go make ourselves some more money. And then we'll get over to the forest to start cutting some trees down. So, let's stop on by the farm here and uh, get these potatoes and strawberries uh, loaded up. Because they are selling for a really good price right now and we could use that money so we will do that now all the money that we have is uh, good money for us now because we have no more no more debt to the bank for hauling hay and cattle company and we purchased that other farm and hopefully soon we'll be able to purchase the main farm we need to find out what the bank is wanting for that main farm because we were told we were going to have to pay more than the original price so we'll have to see what we need to save up for there and then uh, we have the good old redneck days uh, coming around in the spring and we need to get ourselves a tractor for redneck days but we need some money in order to get ourselves a tractor that we can use in redneck days all right well let's get these loaded up here but we need to probably adjust our trailer there so we can load this better so let's do that There we go, we got our sides put down. So we get this all loaded up and then we will go sell it down at the restaurant and uh, get ourselves a little money for these potatoes and strawberries. We're gonna go ahead and sell what we got in the shed here. And uh, Hopefully, that would give us a nice bit of money here. So, we'll get these all loaded up and we will see you uh, once we're about finished uh, loading these and we'll go sell them. So, we'll be right back with you all here shortly. All right, welcome back everybody. Uh, we have the potatoes here. That's all we have right now. So uh, 9,000 liters of potatoes that we're gonna go sell down to the restaurant. And then we gotta load up the strawberries. 
but we kind of need to think about getting uh, a better um, low loader or even maybe using the truck to move this around. This is quite a heavy load for this little tractor actually. <laughs> so let's get on down to the restaurant and sell these and see what kind of money we get. All right, well, here we go. We're here at the restaurant, so let's pull on over in here and sell these and see what we get. $5,556. We'll take that. All right, let's go on back to the farm and we'll get some strawberries loaded and we'll go get those sold at the restaurant as well. So we'll see you in a little bit, everybody. Welcome back, everybody. Well, we got the strawberries all loaded on the truck and trailer, so let's go to the restaurant and sell these and see what we can get for this load here. 6,000 liters of strawberries so let's go see what we can get this sold for and then we need to get down to the old forest and uh, get some logging done All right, here we are. Let's get this sold. The money is going up. We can start thinking about that tractor we need to get for redneck days now. $3,000 there. See what we get for this little bit here. One thousand seven hundred and twenty-nine. All right, so that was a nice little sale. We're up to nineteen thousand three hundred and seventy dollars. All right, let's go back to the farm and uh, we're gonna get all set up and get down to that forest to do some logging. I think we'll probably lease a, a bigger logging trailer for logs. So we'll see you at the forest. All right, welcome back, everybody. Let's get some of this loaded up here, and we'll go put our first load into the sawmill. And then we'll go to biomass heating plant, and then carpentry. So, let's get a load here loaded up. and get it over there to the sawmill. All right, well, it looks like that uh, we don't have a sawmill in the area. Maybe that's why the bank was wanting us to work this to maybe for economic development to build a sawmill here. So it looks like we will be uh, rotating between the biomass heating plant and carpentry and maybe hauling sails. So let's take this first one to carpentry then. And we'll go sell this over at carpentry get it started into the production. Ooh, our snow. Our snow is gone. It's getting closer to spring, everybody. Oh, no. All right, well, we got to take it easy to get this over there. We don't want 
to wreck this trailer. Thank goodness carpentry is right down the road here. Let's pull this in here. This is gonna be a this is gonna be a bit of a chore. We're gonna have to back that in there, I think. Get it in there a little bit better. That should work. Now, let's uh, put her in there. $8,413. All right. Well, now, let's go ahead and get another load. And we will sell it at the biomass heating plant then. And then. All right, well, this is just a little bit of a load, but we're going to quit logging for now. And we got other things to do. Three thousand three hundred and two dollars. All right, we're gonna take a look and see if there's any contracts. No contracts available. All right. Well, let's head on back down to the forest for a minute. Wow, this land in this forest, there is lots of trees, everybody, and this is going to take a while, so probably cut down some of these trees in behind the scenes. This is a lot of trees. Well, you know, hey, there's lots to do. We got to make some money. We got to get things moving. And uh, we got to make hauling hay and cattle company successful as well as making grandpa feel really good so we got lots of lots of things to do Ooh, we better not get stuck in that mud all right well I think that uh, we better get busy and cutting another tree down so let's get this tractor moved out of the way here a little bit so we don't hurt our tractor any. Let's get another tree cut down so we can open this up a little bit more. We're going to have to clean up our stumps too so our stumps don't get in the way here. But we've done a load to uh, the carpentry, a load to the biomass heating plant, and a load to Holland sales because there is no sawmill in the area, and that might be why the bank wants us to clear this land. But once we clear this land, then there's no other logging. So a bit, a bit concerned about that, but who knows? The old bank might have just been confused and couldn't remember that uh, there wasn't a sawmill here and was confusing that with the carpentry business. So it's okay. We'll we'll switch rotations and do a uh, load to carpentry, biomass, and Holland sales. So that's the way we'll do it, no matter what the prices are. So there is lots of land to clear. Let's uh, grab this tree over here and uh, see if we can get it to fall right over that way behind our trailer so we don't hit nothing. So let's get ready to get the old chainsaw out and uh, get right to it. All right, perfect. Well, let's get this uh, trimmed up here and get busy. Oh, no. 
Oh no. What? Oh. Grandpa? Grandpa, where are you at? Gus? Grandpa? Gus? I'm on the other side of the truck. Okay, Grandpa. <sighs> Grandpa, what's going on? Gus, I'm sorry. I shouldn't scare you when you're cutting a tree with a chainsaw. I apologize. But hey, it's about springtime and construction has started for redneck days, so... I want to show you what it's all about, so you hop in the truck and leave everything here. We're going to go for a ride. You got it, Gus? Okay, Grandpa. Well, let's get in the truck and see what Redneck Days is about. At least go see where Redneck Days is. All right, Gus, get on out of the forest here, and uh, we will. I'll take you on over to where Redneck Days is held so you can kind of get a feel for what Redneck Days might be like. So go ahead, get out of the forest here, and uh, we'll, we'll see you over there. All right, Gus, now, turn right here. Okay, Grandpa. Okay, Gus, make sure you turn right here, too. Okay, Grandpa. All right, now, the Redneck Days is just down the road here. On the right-hand side. Okay, Grandpa. Whoa, look at this, everybody. What? What is going on here? Well, Gus, <clears throat> this is Redneck Days. The community has a local farmer that lets them set up on a field and they construct a, a new Redneck Days every season where farmers compete in a special event. A special event, Grandpa? What's that? Well, Gus, it's called Redneck Days. It's all I'm gonna tell you. So just drive through here and show the people. Okay, Grandpa. Wow, Grandpa, this is neat. A lot of hard workers put into setting this all up and getting it ready for redneck days. This must be the, the way into the parking lot right here. And then they got a, a loop around it so people can get out safely. And they can loop back around across the way here. Now this must be the way to the to the pits here. They can have all their rescue squads and tow trucks and everything sit off here on the right hand side behind this safety wall. And here here looks like a pit area right here. Where competitors can park. Yeah. <clears throat> That's right, Gus. Now, Gus, you need to find yourself a tractor, you understand? Okay, Grandpa, but where do I find a tractor? Well, Gus, this entire time, Harry said that there's been a tractor sitting by a, a shed up at the farm. A tractor by a shed at the farm, Grandpa. What are you talking about? I don't know, Gus. Just listen, all right? Okay, Grandpa. Well, Gus, I gotta go for now. 
So you stop right here. Okay, Grandpa. Grandpa? Grandpa? Where'd you go? Grandpa?